Hey, all my fashionistas and fashionistas out there, it's your plus size fashionista. Mm hmm. Yep. And this is going to be a review, compare and contrast on the new lipstick that I just received from MAC, and it is called Pure Heroin. So, if you guys want to stick around and stay tuned for, you know, the lippy and my thoughts and opinions about it, then y'all know what to do. Keep it locked, honey nieces. Mm-hmm. Yep. Hey, all my fashionistas and fashionistas out there. It's your plus size fashionista. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, all oh my fans, she's Divas and Dolls. Like I was saying in the intro before, this is going to be a review for Max Pure Heroin lipstick. If you guys do not know, it was released, I think, a week ago or a couple days ago. And this is a lipstick for Lord, however you say her name. Um, and it is called Pure Heroin. And this is it no fancy type packaging and this is amplify and it was sixteen dollars and mac has free shipping on their website so it was like 1668 the tax and you know it's free shipping so it came rather quickly so this is pure heroin right here and i'm gonna have some of my honeys ask me um about heroin i posted this picture uh a picture of me on uh facebook and some of my honeys was asking me what's the difference so i don't have the tube anymore but it's the potty but i'm going to swatch it on my hand and i'm gonna put it right next to pure heroin this is heroin and i'm going to Get a nice, good, and even swatch. Now, this is heroin. That's pure heroin. Now, it's nowhere in the same color family. Yeah, it's purples, but to me, heroin is more of a pinky, purpley based um, purple. And this heroin, the pure heroin, is more of a blue base to me it's more deeper like a purple a rich purple color i mean um so only matte color i could think of that may come close is my punk couture which i'm gonna swatch this punk couture and this is punk couture and it is no no comparison um i did see somebody's video i'm gonna shout her out um platinum and she did do you know a compare and contrast and all that i wasn't gonna do that i've been you know sending people you know to watch her video but everybody wanted me to do it so i'm like okay fine i'll do it um i did see in her video she said if you um put heroin and cyber together you'll get pure heroin so we are going to do that live so this is cyber That's cyber. And I'm going to get a little bit more of heroin. And rub it in. So this is cyber and heroin. I'm going to put a little bit more cyber on it. And mix it. So, that's cyber and heroin. And that is pure heroin. So, I think they are right. So, I'm going to let y'all know 
Pure heroin is an amplifier, and I'm going to give you guys my guy, Honest True. It's a pretty color. I'm loving it. Those that know me know I love purple. So if you're a Lord fan, you're going to get it. If you're a purple wear or you're uh you love purple purple is your favorite color then or you just a avid purple lippy wear then you're gonna get it but uh will i tell you to go out and get it no i mean you can find different dupes in your collection or you could just do what i just showed you to do and you know you had your own pure heroin um i mean is it a must buy no but i'm an avid purple lippy lover so of course i got it I'm not a fan of Lord, but I do love some of her music. Um, I will tell you, I like the consistency on my lips. It's not drying. It's very moisturizing. Um, it's not matte, so matte lipsticks tend to dry out your lips. So if you're more of a matte girl, I would say, you know, stick to matte lippies. Me, you know, I own several of matte lipsticks. I mean, I don't prefer one over the other oh i like this better you know majority of my collection is matte i can't say but you can you know turn mattes into amplifiers or whatever just add gloss or whatever you want to do um i will tell you that it would be best if you use a lip liner with this because i did put it on without a lip liner and I know this only put like one coat on and it is like really streaky and I do not like that. So with this, you're going to need at least two to three coats to get that nice even pigmentation and nice um, even coating on your lips. If that gives you guys more of a visual um, as well as, um, you know, it is long lasting. But again, if you want it to be more uh longer lasting i would highly recommend use a lip liner i use my nika k uh i think it's dark orchid lip liner you can find it at your local beauty supply store um and i noticed you know it made you know the color pop more um of this lipstick if that gives you guys a visual so you know i'm not gonna say i don't like it i'm gonna say i hate it i just got it today so more and more i wear it you know of course you follow me on instagram facebook of course i'm gonna update you um if you guys want me to update you on here make a follow-up video i can um but so far i'm digging it and it's just pure heroin with the nika k i think dark orchid lip liner that's all i have but i did put it on by itself I wasn't feeling it. So, if you're going to wear this ladies by itself, you're going to need at least two to three coats for it to be very even and not really streaky. I noticed, like, it's really streaky. So, if you don't like that streaky look and you want the color to be bold and pop, then you're going to need a lip liner. So, yeah, honeys, that's it. I want you to do one thing for me. Stay fly, stay fashionable for less also. Tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to my channel. Y'all know what I want y'all to do, right? Mm-hmm. Yep.